Hello, everybody. Welcome. Welcome to the class. Today, we're going to read a book. Uh, what book are we going to read? We're going to read a book about being healthy. How can we be healthy, strong, and, and uh, healthy, not sick? <coughs> not sick. Hmm? How can we be healthy? Let's look at the book. Let's look at the book. Here it is. It's called Healthy Me. Healthy Me. The main character in this book is this girl. She will help us understand how to be healthy. Hmm? Let's read. I like being healthy, she says. When I am healthy, I feel good. I am in a better mood. I have more energy. Everyone needs to stay healthy. What about you? Do you think it's important to be healthy? When you are healthy, do you feel good? I do. When I'm healthy, I feel good. I'm in a better mood. What is a mood? A mood is happy or sad, angry or mm, irritated. I like to be in a happy mood in a good mood, but if we are not feeling good in our bodies or emotionally, maybe we don't have a good mood, right? What is she doing? She's playing tennis. <laughs> tennis. Do you play tennis to be healthy? What sports do you like to play to be healthy. Please tell us in the comments. Tell us what kind of sports do you like to play to be healthy? Uh, let's look at the internet. We're going to look at some sports, okay? What kind of sports do you, do you play to be healthy? Let's see. Let's type in popular sports. Popular sports. Uh, oh, I see a basketball. I see baseball. I see soccer. Tennis. Football. That's American football. Volleyball. You know volleyball? I like volleyball. And what's this? This is badminton. Badminton. Mm -hmm. You use a shuttle. You see that thing? That white thing? That's called a shuttle. You use a shuttle to play badminton. Oh, look. These are two white golf balls. Do you play golf? I don't. And this is, um, it looks like a jump rope. Jump rope. Do you jump rope? Look. Do you do you jump rope? Eh? I don't. I don't jump rope. No, I don't. I don't have a jump rope. I don't have a jump rope. Let's go back to the book. Healthy me. She says, "I like to be active and move my body." She likes to be active and move her body. I run, I swim, and ride my bike. Do you have a bike? Hmm? Do you ride your bike? Let's look at pictures, okay? Let's look at pictures. Let's go to the internet. Internet, okay. Let's look at ride a bike. 
ride a bike. I don't have a bike. Do you? What are they doing? They are riding a bike. They are riding a bike. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. What about swimming? Let's look at pictures of swimming. Do you see them? What are they doing? They are swimming. <clears throat> I really like swimming. Yeah, I do. I like swimming. Do you like swimming? Tell us in the comments, okay? Say, Teacher Jim, I like to swim. Or, Teacher Jim, I don't like to swim. Okay, let's go back to the book. Back to the book. Okay, here it is. She says, I take walks. I take walks with my big brother, Bill. Bill is his name. And our dog, Wilbur. There's Wilbur. So she takes walks. <laughs> Sorry, I sneezed. She takes walks with Bill and Wilbur. Wilbur is their dog. Mm -hmm. Do you have a dog? I have some dogs outside in the garden. Yeah, I like dogs. Do you? Please tell us in the comments. Say, I like dogs or... No, I don't like dogs. Okay. Do you take walks? Do you take walks in the park? Or do you take walks at the beach? Maybe you take a walk around the neighborhood. I sometimes go for a walk around the neighborhood. I like to go for a walk to get some exercise and to be active and to move my body, my body. All right, let's turn the page. I like to play sports. Soccer is my favorite game. I also take hikes in the woods with my family. Mm-hmm. So what are they doing right now? What sport are they playing right now? They are playing soccer. Yeah. In America, in the United States of America, we call this game soccer. Mm -hmm. Other places call this football, right? Uh, maybe because you kick it with your foot. I don't know. But Americans in the United States call it soccer. She says that she likes to take hikes in the woods with her family. What is a hike? What are the woods? Let's look at pictures. Okay? Let's look at pictures. Let's go to the internet and look at some pictures. All right? Let's go. Let's look at the woods, okay? The woods. Do you see the woods? Let's look at beautiful woods. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at these woods. Oh, these woods are so beautiful. There are so many trees in the woods. Look, oh, beautiful woods. Forest, right? Forest, woods, uh huh. Many plants all over the place. Oh, wow, look at this beautiful pond in the woods, in the forest. Okay, now, what is take a hike? What does that mean to hike in the woods? Let's see. Hike in the woods. Let's look at the pictures. Ah, ha, ha, look at what they are doing. They are hiking in the woods. Yes, they have their backpacks. What, what are in the, the backpacks? Eh? 
or what what is in the backpack? Food, probably. Water. Mm. Food and water are in the backpacks. Because when I go hiking, I need to bring food and water with me. What are they doing? <clears throat> what are they doing? They are hiking in the woods. He has a set of binoculars. Yeah, look. Look at these binoculars. Do you bring binoculars into the woods? Maybe you want to look at the birds. Oh, look at the beautiful birds. You bring the binoculars into the woods. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Binoculars in the woods. Do you see them? What are they doing? They are using the binoculars in the woods. Yeah, they are. Okay. Do you like hiking? Please tell us in the comments if you like hiking, all right? Please. I want to know. I want to learn more about you. Mm -hmm. I like hiking. I really do. I like hiking in the woods. It's very peaceful, relaxing, calming. It makes me feel good. And I get exercise. Like the little girl in the book. Let's go back to the book. Look, she gets exercise. She is active. She moves her body. She is healthy. Are you? Can you, can you be active? Okay. She says, I like television but I don't watch it for hours. She doesn't watch television for hours. I like computer games, but I don't play them for hours. Okay. Everyone needs to get up and move around. Good. Eating well gives me energy, she says. Eating well gives me energy. If I skip breakfast, I don't think very well. Everyone needs to eat a good breakfast. What is she having for breakfast? Look. She has a cup of milk, a banana, and cereal. Is that a healthy, good breakfast? Is she eating well? What do you think? You can tell us in the comments. What do you think? Is she eating well? You can type... I don't think she's eating well. No. Or you can type, yes, I think she's eating well. I think she's eating a healthy breakfast to give her energy. Okay. So she said she doesn't.
Hello, we're back. Sorry, I lost internet connection, I think. Uh, what did I miss? Or what did you miss? Are we back now? Are we good? Hello? Yeah, we're back. We're back. Okay, so we're going to look at what are video games. Let's see. Let's go to the internet. And we type in uh, computer games first. We will look at computer games. Computer games are games that are played on the computer. Do you have a computer? Do you play computer games on the computer? Please tell us in the comments. Tell us in the comments, all right? Do you play computer games on the computer? Okay. Hello, Elizabeth S. How are you, Elizabeth S? Are you good? Nice to see you. Welcome to the class. Okay. So, let's go to... Uh, video games now. Let's see. What are video games? Video games. Let's see. Video games are games that are played on consoles. Okay. Video game consoles. What are video game consoles? Let's see. Look. Uh, video game consoles are different gaming systems that you can play games with. Uh, you see, this is Xbox. That is one video game console. And this is, uh, what's this? Place with Sega? Sega. That's one video game console. Um, also, Nintendo. Nintendo, that is a video game console, okay? Do you play video games? Which console do you use? Tell us in the comments, all right? Good. Let's go back to the book, okay? Back to the book, all right? So the girl in the book... She likes to play computer games, but she doesn't play computer games for hours because she wants to be healthy. She wants to be healthy. Okay. Good. I eat a good lunch at school, she, she says. Peanut butter and jelly is my favorite sandwich. I drink lots of milk and water. What do you think? Eh? What do you think? Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Is that healthy? You can say, yeah, I think that's healthy. Or no, I don't think peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are healthy. No. Write your answer in the comments. Okay. Hi, Pick. Hi, Pick. I'm reading a book, and we're talking about how to be healthy. Okay? So I can answer your questions about Call of Duty later. All right? Thank you, Pick. Okay. So... Let's look at some pictures of peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Okay. Pick, Pick says that peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are 50% healthy. That's half. Half healthy. Pick, why do you say that peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are half Half healthy, half unhealthy. Half healthy, half unhealthy. 
Why? Why do you say that? Okay. So let's go to the internet. Okay. Let's go to the internet and we'll type in peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Okay. Are these healthy? Do you like them? Personally, I do. I do like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I like them. Are they healthy? I don't know. I'm not a doctor. So let's go back to the book. Okay. Let's go back to the book. Okay, she says, I eat a good lunch at school. Peanut butter and jelly is my favorite sandwich. I drink lots, lots of milk and water. Mm -hmm. Do you like to drink milk? What kind of milk do you drink? Let's go to the internet. Let's look at kinds of milk. Kinds of milk, okay? Let's go. And we will type kinds of milk. Wow. Look at the different kinds of milk. We have skim milk. Skim milk. Skim milk has fewer calories. Skim milk has fewer calories. Okay. 1%, 1% fat milk. Uh, it has more calories than the skim milk. Okay. 1% has more calories than the skim milk. 2% milk has more calories than the 1% milk. Whole milk has the most calories. Whole milk has the most calories. This milk comes from a cow usually, okay? Some people like to drink goat milk, you see? Look, do you see this? It's goat milk. <coughs> you know what a goat is? Nah. Some people like to drink goat milk, okay? There, there are many kinds of milk, many kinds. I, I really like to drink soy milk, organic soy milk, okay? I like to drink organic soy milk. I, I also like to drink almond and cashew milk. I like almond and cashew milk. Let's look. Let's look. Almond and cashew. Do you see? These are almonds and cashews. These are almonds and cashews. Yeah. I like to drink almond cashew milk. Do you like to drink that? Pick says... Pick, our friend Pick says, oat milk or plain milk? Oat milk or plain milk, he says. Thank you for your answer, Pick. Thank you for your answer. Okay, let's go back to the book. Let's go back to the book. Healthy me. She says, my favorite food is noodles. I also like other healthy foods such as apples. Everyone needs to eat healthy foods. Everyone needs to eat healthy, healthy foods to make us strong. Noodles. Do you like noodles? Let's look at pictures of noodles, okay? Pictures of noodles. Are you ready? Let's go to the internet. All right. 
let's look at pictures of delicious noodles. Mmm, I love delicious noodles. Yummy. Look at these noodles. It looks so yummy. I see broccoli. Uh, I see, uh, is, that, is that red bell pepper or tomato? I see mushrooms. I see mushrooms. I see chicken. I see uh, green bell pepper. You see that? That is green bell pepper. Yeah. I really like bell peppers in my noodles. Look, bell peppers in the noodles. You see? Oh, yeah. Bell peppers are very good. They are yummy. They are delicious. Do you like to use bell peppers in your cooking? Tell us in the comments, okay? All right. Let's go back to the book. Let's go back to the book. Pick says, what is the difference between noodles, spaghetti, and pasta? Very good question. Very good question, Pick. Let's go back to the internet. Look, pasta can be in different shapes. Pasta is in different shapes. This pasta is short and squiggly. Short and squiggly, okay? This pasta is called... Uh, let, let's look at linguine. Look. You see, linguine is like spaghetti, but linguine is fatter. It's fatter. Look, I will show you. So, this is a linguine noodle. This is a linguine noodle. And this, this is a spaghetti noodle, okay? Linguini, right here, linguini and spaghetti, okay? They are both noodles. But this noodle is fatter and this noodle is thinner. What other kinds of pasta are there? Let's see. Let's look at penne pasta. Look, this pasta is called penne. This is a type of pasta. Okay? It's a type of pasta. Very good. Look, this is rigatoni on, on the right. You see? This is penne over here on the left and rigatoni pasta on the right. Okay. Good. Very good. Thank you for your question, Pick. Very good question. Very good. So let's look at penne noodles. And uh, what, what, what other, oh yeah, we have, um, what are those called? Uh, oh, bow ties. Yeah, let's go. Let's see bow ties. Bow tie noodles. All right. So this is a kind of pasta, all right? Bow tie is a kind of pasta. Just like penne is another kind of pasta, spaghetti is another kind of pasta, linguine is another kind of pasta. Let's look. How many, how many kinds of pasta are there? How many? Whoa! There are 350 different types of pasta. Okay? Look at all of the different types of pasta. Wow. Okay, let's go back to the book, okay? Let's go back to the book, yeah. Okay, good. 
So she says, I get plenty of rest. That's a lot of rest. I get plenty of rest. I go to bed earlier on school days. She goes to bed earlier on school days. So on the weekends, Saturday and Sunday, maybe she does not go to bed so early on Saturday and Sunday because Saturdays and Sundays are not school days. She says, and I get up earlier on school days. So she goes to bed earlier and she gets up earlier on school days. My dad says I need 11 to 12 hours of sleep each day because I am growing, growing. What do you think? Do you think that she needs 11 to 12 hours of sleep every day? Tell us in the comments what you think. How many, how many hours of sleep do you get each day? Hmm? Tell us in the comments. Oh, okay. I, I wake up, I wake up at, uh, four o'clock or four 30 every morning, every day because I work. I teach English online, on the computer. Mm -hmm. Okay. She says, I keep my body clean to stay healthy. I wash my hands before eating and after going to the restroom. Washing keeps germs from getting into my body. Do you wash your hands? To stay healthy, let's look at pictures, okay? Let's look at pictures of washing our hands. Pick says that he thinks six hours is uh, is fine for him. Six hours. Okay. Thank you, Pick. Let's go to see uh, washing our hands. So what do we wash our hands with? Wash... Wash hands with soap and water. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We need to wash our hands to stay healthy. We need to wash our bodies. Wash our bodies to stay healthy. Mm -hmm. Good. Let's go back to the book. Go back to the book. Good. What are germs? She says, washing keeps germs from getting into my body. What are germs? If you know what germs are, tell us in the comments, okay? Let's look at pictures. Let's look at pictures of germs. Yeah. Let's look at germs. Do you see the germs? Oh. Look at the germs on his hand, okay? There are many germs on his hand. Uh, we need to wash our hands with soap and water to get rid of the germs. Get rid of the germs. Okay, good. Let's go back to the book. All right, here it is. She says, I brush my teeth three times a day. <laughs> Brushing <laughs> kills germs. Brushing kills germs that cause cavities. Cavities. I also take baths and showers. 
everyone needs to wash. Everyone needs to wash to stay healthy. So let's look at cavities in the teeth, okay? Let's look at cavities in the teeth. Ready? Let's look at the internet and we will go to uh, cavities in the teeth. Oh no, look, ah, uh, look at the cavity. Oh, this is a cavity. The cavity gets worse over time. Ah, uh, we need to brush our teeth. We need to brush our teeth to avoid cavities. We need to brush our teeth to kill the bad germs in the mouth. Okay. Now, what is uh, a bath? What is a bath? Okay, let's look. A bath. We take a bath in the bathtub, you see? We take a bath in the bathtub tub. What is a shower? What is a shower? Let's look. Let's look. A shower stall. We take a shower in the shower stall. Yeah. We take a shower in the shower stall. The shower stall. All right. Do you take baths in a bathtub or do you take showers in a shower stall? Please tell us in the comments. Please tell us in the comments, all right? Okay, let's go back to the book. Back to the book, yeah. All right, here it is. Okay. She says, I have many kinds of feelings. Some are happy and some are sad. Laughing, <laughs> laughing makes me feel better. It makes me feel better. Yeah. Pick. What is the difference between I took a shower or I took a bath? Well, pick. A shower, let's look at the pictures again, okay? Let's look at the pictures again. No, they are not the same. They are not the same, okay? Let's look at the pictures. You see, you see the shower stall, right? You take a shower standing up. You stand up in the shower stall and the water comes from above you and you, you take a shower, okay? Take a shower in the shower stall. But the bathtub is not a shower stall. A bathtub is like this. You see? We take a bath in the bathtub. We take a bath. We, we are in the bathtub like this. Yeah? Like this. And we are washing washing our body in the bathtub okay wash the body in the bathtub it is not the same it is different thank you for your question pick let's go back to the book yes back to the book so she says laughing makes me feel better <laughs> When I have sad feelings, I feel better when I talk about them with Bill, her brother, mom, or dad. So, does laughing make you feel better? <laughs> does laughing make you feel better? When, when you have sad feelings, when you have sad feelings, 
Who do you talk to? Who do you talk to, huh? When you have sad feelings, who do you talk to? Uh, do you talk to your mom? Do you talk to your brother? Do you talk to your teacher? Who do you talk to? Pick. Pick says, there is a shower in the bathtub in my country. Okay. Look. Look, Pick. Let's go to here and we will type in bathtub and shower combo. Okay. Bathtub and shower combo. Combo. Okay. Look at this. This is the shower head. Okay. You see pick, right? This is the shower head and this is the bath tub. If you stand in the shower, if you stand in the shower and you are washing like this, you are showering. You are taking a shower, okay? But if you are in the bathtub like this, if you are in the bathtub like this and you are washing, you are taking a bath, okay? That is the difference. Good. Let's go back to the book. Let's go back to the book. Okay. Sometimes I like quiet time. Quiet. Shh, shh. Quiet time. When I do, I watch my tropical fish. She has tropical fish. She says... I imagine that I am floating through the water. I'm sorry. She says, I imagine that I am floating through water. Floating through water. Everyone needs quiet time. Do you like quiet time? Do you like quiet time? Let's look at floating. Let's look at floating. What is floating? Let's look. Okay. Floating through water. Floating through water. Let's see. What is she doing? She's floating through the water. She's floating through the water. Okay. Do you like to float through the water? Do you like that? Tell us in the comments. Okay. Very good. What's she doing? What is she doing? She's floating through the water. Floating. Okay, good. Let's go back to the book. Hello, Hung Vo. Welcome, Hung Vo, to the live stream, to the class. Welcome from Vietnam. Or wait, Hung Vo. Uh, you, you said that you're you're living somewhere in the United States, right? You're living somewhere in the United States now? Okay, let's go share the book again. Here it is. That's it. That's the book, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for reading the book with me. If you have any questions, please send me a message, okay? Send me a message. Like the video if you learned some new words, okay? Please like the video if you learned some new words all right like the video thank you and please send the video send the video to your friends 
and family so they can learn more English. All right. Thank you so much. I will see you next time. Send me messages. Okay. If you want to talk to me, send me messages. Bye-bye. Thank you.